hi guys welcome back again to my channel if you're coming across this channel for the very first time you are highly welcome to my channel in this video i'll be sharing with you guys a very nice face routine an effective face routine you can do every night or two times in a week that is you can probably do it maybe in the weekend or you can do it every night depending on the kind of schedule you have okay so if you're the kind of person that don't like to stress too much on skincare products, you don't like, you don't have time for skincare routines, then um, you can do this every weekend. Or if you're the kind of person that your work is just during the daytime, you can do this at night only. And I am here to like give you guys the best and effective um, skincare products that you can use on your face and then i am going to be telling you how to use them and also tell you the words to use one after the other this is for somebody that is targeting to get a glassy skin a glowy skin and a perfect skin like this routine is actually bomb like it's everything you actually need okay so i'm going to start by um telling you the face cleanser and then like that like that okay so anyway guys um, the face cleanser I am going to be recommending in this video is the Ceramide Face Cleanser. I'm going to show you guys around the screen like I used to. So if you don't know this face cleanser, I am going to show you what it looks like. Now this Ceramide um, Face Cleanser is actually one of the best cleanser because it is very mild to the face. It's gentle to the face and it doesn't have any fragrance and apart from that it's very good like the size is actually very perfect the size is very perfect like you don't need to worry about getting a new skincare in the next week or the next two weeks or next few weeks this actually lasts it lasts a lot okay so especially if you're using it at night um every night or during the weekdays it actually lasts a lot okay so now what you are going to do first is to use this particular cleanser on your face okay use it on your face at night time when i mean night time i don't mean when you are done bathing and then you want to go and cook no when i'm what i mean by night time is when you are done bathing when you are done with your skincare routine and then you just want to go and sleep that is what i mean by night time i don't mean when you are done using this skincare product then you go out there again to go and stress yourself like cooking washing of dishes washing of clothes no you don't need any sweat once you are done this is like one of the um hack on skincare once you are done with your night routine skincare just go and sleep if you have anything to do that night do them then you do your skincare routine and then you go and sleep straight do you get so that is one thing about that is one act about skincare so like i was saying this um product is actually very nice and yeah after applying it on your face you gently apply it on your face um in circular motions apply here and here as well your nose areas here as well after applying this you don't rinse off immediately that is another hack after applying this you wait for like two minutes or three minutes just let it dry on your face and then you wash off okay at that moment you already notice your 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 face is clean is smooth and the rest of things like that like that okay then it doesn't stop there i am going to be recommending skin by zaron um toner so this is what skin by zaron toner actually looks like i'm gonna show you guys and you guys already know what toner actually works for toner is very very good actually those of you that are doing night time night routine or weekday routine so toners are very very good when you use it is either you use this um skin by zaron toner or you use the um this liquorized toner i'm going to show you guys what it looks like around the screen like i used to okay so i've talked about this this toner before in one of my videos it's also nice so it's actually you is is either you go for this skin by zaron or you go for this one this actually brightens the skin and this helps to get rid of hyperpigmentation so it's actually a lightning toner because it really works this actually is very effective but if you're looking for something that will hydrate your skin and then it will brighten your skin 
and give you this glowy skin as well then you go for the skin by zaron but if you're looking for something that will get rid of your hyperpigmentation that would focus on your acne your oily skin then you can also go for this one so that's the difference between the two of them so if you have used this product before you know what i'm talking about so after you have cleansed your 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 face with your ceramide face wash you go in go on to using your toner to apply on your face now you don't rub your toners on your face you apply them gently on your face like you apply it gently on your face make sure it goes in like when you are doing a nighttime routine you need to take your time it might even take up to an hour just after cleansing your face or washing your face with your ceramide face wash or face cleanser then you go on to using your skin by zaron toner to gently apply on your face do not rub it do not scrub just apply gently to your face make sure that you use the ones that are enough like use the measurement that is going to be enough the ones that you use on your face and then you feel the hydration on your face because if it dries out very fast just know that you use little and you are not supposed to use little toner okay toners are not meant to be used um little you need to use enough toners on your face let let it let it go because it's not something you rub so it doesn't go a long way like make sure you um dap it on your face um in different places on your face everywhere on your face and as well you can also use it on your neck now if you're using a toner you can either use um a cutting pad or a cutting wool which i'm going to show you guys around here you can also use your hands that's if you trust yourself if, if you can use your hands if you know that your hands are very clean then you can use your hands for me i use the cutting pad like i've said in one of my videos so moving on to another product i'm going to be recommending is the face mask and you guys already know like I really love face masks so much like recently i really love face masks because i found out that it's actually very hydrating and it does a lot on the face like immediately you apply it on your face and then take it out you see a lot of changes on your face like you notice the softness and all that on your face so another thing i'm going to be recommending is a face mask and you guys already know i talk about vitamin c face mask for those of you that are trying to brighten your skin your face um you know mostly your face you want to brighten your face you can use the vitamin c face mask then if you want something very soothing hydrating you know stuff like that then you can go for either aloe vera or um or strawberry you know other face masks like that but in this video i'm just talking about brightening your face and the one i'm going to be recommending is vitamin c face mask from any brand okay any brand can actually go with it okay so after applying that on your face then you are like to sit on your face for a while and um i like to sit on your face for like five minutes to ten minutes then you can take it out remember after the toner you don't just apply your mask you don't just put your mask okay just remember that after the toner you can wait for at least um five ten minutes then you apply your face mask and as well wait for five to ten minutes then you can do the next one that you can apply the next product so for those of you that are looking to brighten under your eyes um or you know make it look make it look very smart or very sharp very cute you know make it to rhyme with your face um i'll just recommend you use um an eye mask okay i'm gonna show you guys the eye mask i really i mean so after applying that one on your face you just let it sit on your face for at least five to ten minutes again and then you take it out i'm going to be recommending the world medics health hub eye mask and it is very very effective for those of you that are looking to brighten your eye your under eye it's very very effective so like i said you leave that um to sit on your face for like five to ten minutes as well then you take it out and then you go in with another product which i'm going to be recommending your, your your face is a bit saggy like you're having wrinkles your face is having this um aging look and all that i recommend you go in with retinol serum but if you're looking to brighten your face that just go for um vitamin c serum another one i'm going to be recommending is, is a moisturizer and the moisturizer i'm going to be recommending is a very very hydrating one a very very 
hydrating moisturizer so you can get this moisturizer here um this moisturizer is very hydrating remember with all these things you have done you need something that will hold in the moisture so you don't need something that will just dry it out just remember when you are using your moisturizer you need to um apply it under here for me i don't apply an eye cream because i feel like moisturizer does a lot work a lot work under here than um an eye cream so um a moisturizer that is very hydrating and has a very good ingredients will work for your under eye and your face as well even your neck area so that's why i'm going to be recommending this moisturizer this moisturizer is very very effective let me know in the comment section if you have used this moisturizer and i so much love it so another one i'll be telling you guys about um is a sunscreen and for me i don't use sunscreen at night so um everybody is different if you want to use sunscreen um then i'm going to recommend you use this one or this one so for me i don't use sunscreen at night and i don't use um sunscreen every time okay so this sunscreen is actually a bomb like a lot of people have been using this sunscreen and they said it's from korea you know stuff like that if i am to use sunscreen like if i am to you know decide to get a sunscreen then i will get this one because it's actually made for both body and face as well and it is very hydrating very effective as well for me i don't really like the way sunscreen makes me sweat and all that but i've heard a lot of things about this sunscreen which i which uh, made me to say okay i'm going to try it out now i'm recommending it because it's actually very very effective okay so that's it guys so much for watching this video i'll see you later in my next one okay bye